What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today we're going to be trying to figure out the formula for my custom Elite Fantasy Attire Red Kenny Omega. Alright guys, so in today's video, as you can see right here, we have the man Kenyo Omega in the middle. We got the SummerSlam 2017 Seth Rollins. We got the Best of Attitude Era Chris Jericho. The NXT Series 3, or I think it's Series 3, guys. I can't effing remember. So many series just getting pumped out the target now. You don't know what series it is. But we have that Bobby Roode. We have a Network Spotlight Triple H fodder right here, and then we have this uh, Walmart exclusive Flashback Series X-Pac. And what I'm trying to figure out is I want to do a fantasy attire Kenny Omega. I want the cleaner to look clean in his red. I want him to have red and black and possibly white in his attire, but I'm trying to figure out what formula I want to use for this figure. I know the head scan I'm going to use. I already have the parts on the way for that. I'm going to use the DDP hairpiece, obviously. I might possibly sculpt. Probably not going to, but it is possible. I thought about doing it, but I don't know. I, 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 I want to get some epoxy. I don't want to use the Milliput trash. Don't use Milliput, guys. Pay the extra money. Get the epoxy. Anyways, right here. That's what I'm using for the head scan. We're using DDP hairpiece, and then we're using the Daniel Bryan head scan from Elite 19. I found a bunch of basics on eBay, just bought them up so that I can make future Kenny Omegas just because that's the best head scan. I like the long beard. Makes him look like a badass. I want him to look badass on Vindication. So that's what we got going for the head scan. For the torso, I'm kind of torn because uh, the last time I made my white attire Kenny Omega, everybody was pooping on my family because they were like, you know what, bro, that's just a Seth Rollins or whatever. And uh, I got a lot of crap for it. So I thought about just taking the SummerSlam Seth Rollins, acetoning off the chest hair, changing out the arms, and just sort of painting up this red attire. And, uh, you know, just running with that, popping the custom head on there and running with it. But I don't want to get crap done again. So I thought about taking maybe the legs from the Seth Rollins, putting them on the Bobby Roode with the better torso. I don't know. I, I just don't know what to do. I also have this torso I could possibly use. And another thing I thought about was maybe just uh, torso cracking this Jericho with either the Bobby Roode or the Triple H or the Seth Rod, whatever, because uh, this red's a different color red. It's more brighter, more saturated than the Seth Rollins back here. And I would just acetone off the designs, put the torso on there, and then switch the lower legs with some other kick pads or paint them up or possibly put the Seth Rollins kick pads on there because it has black and red. So there's literally so many different ways we could do it. And then here's one of my favorite parts. Um, we could even just switch out the lower legs on this Triple H fodder and have, you know, the red be right here. But I wanted it to be mainly red, like full red tights, black and white accents, possibly gold in there. Uh, like this Xbox right here on the kick pads, you'll see you have black, red, and gold on the kick pad. And I really love these kick pads. I think they would look super fresh for Kenny, especially if you popped them on the Seth Rollins or the Jericho uh, upper legs. I just think those reds and golds and blacks all together would look very freaking sick, especially with some Omega logos or some bullsh like that. Like I think that would be a really nice idea. But I'm torn, guys. I don't know if I want to, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be a Frankenstein effort, obviously. I'm just going to have to put, uh, maybe it's going to be a mixture of all five figures right here i'm not sure i need you guys to comment down below which torso to use first of all do we want to use the seth rollins torso do we want to use the bobby Roode torso or do we want to use the rick flair damian Mizdow, triple h torso that we got right here we also need to figure out our legs do we want to use you know these are on ball joints the, uh, the bobby Roode is on bob ball joints so you could pop the legs off and pop some different legs in there, but that would require painting the crotch piece, which I don't know if I want to do that either. So I'm basically just uh, posting this video up to you guys to get your opinion on it. I need help figuring out what I want to do for this fantasy attire Kenny Omega. I've literally went to like five different people asking their opinions, and nobody can really help me. They're pretty much saying, screw you. No, I'm just kidding. They're not saying that, but they're they're... They didn't have any ideas either, so it's actually a tough challenge because Kenny Omega usually just wears plain black. So I want to get away from plain black, and I want to do a red attire. I don't know why red's in my head, but I think red would look really fresh. I thought about even doing blue down the line, like a light blue color, but we will see about that. But today's video is all about the red, and I need your guys' help. You know, kick pads, leg choice, torso choice. But another thing goes with the Bobby Roode. If I use the Bobby Roode torso, 
then I'd have to switch out the shoulders because I think these shoulders are a bit large for Kenny Omega. So I don't know. I mean, I'm just lost, guys. So please let me know down in the comment section below which combination of parts you would like to see used. Uh, the head scan, I know for sure what I'm doing. I just love this head scan. Look at him. He looks like a bad A. Looks like he's going to assassinate your family. Just looks so nice. So I like the head scan there. Need help for the rest. And uh, I'm just going to paint some cool designs on there because painting is my talent, not sculpting or any of that trash. So uh, thank you guys for watching this video. Again, comment down below the formula you'd like to see used. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Cleaner.